see that. Shalom, shalom. I'm Brother Corral. Brother I'm one. And when we get our praise and honor glory to Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shah by Hashem, Rakakadash. Double honor and blessing to the elders, the apostle of great millstone. The water Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shah for the elders, the apostle on down, for working us up to the wisdom, our truth, and understanding. Through the spirit power of Yahweh by Hashem, Yahweh Shah. Shout out to the few Akim that are doing the truth and sincerely across the four corners of the earth where you might be scattered abroad, along with the confusion of faces. Mm -hmm. Shout out to the few Akwa as well. Meaning the sisters, the one who repent and come back to you. How about you, Masha, as well? With that, we say, uh, Shalom. All right, what we're getting to today is basically just, you know, just going over precepts, going to that, hey, the Lord, when Yahweh Shah get ready to return, man, the Lord going to reject a lot of people. Because as you can see, a lot of folks say they believe in God. Yeah, I believe in God. Uh, I believe in Yahweh. I believe in Yahweh Shah. But when it comes to their action and their works, they don't show. Mm -hmm. So, that's why a lot of that, that's why the scripture in Matthew chapter 7 say they're going to be like, you know, roughly paraphrasing, quoting, saying, hey, have we not in your name prophesied in your name, cast out devils? And the Lord said, he's going to tell them to depart from me. I never knew you. Because mm -hmm. the, the only thing our people really do, because really you're going to have, yeah, you actually going to have, you know, people out there prophesizing and teaching, but they also got false doctrine. And they also, <laughs> when the Lord get ready to make their return, they're going to Swear and think they had the right teaching going on, but the Lord gonna like, no, nah, that's why this is that why that scripture there. Have we not did this prophesied and in your name? Cause right, <laughs> you got counts know the name. They know Yahweh, Yahweh Shah, they know the name, but they got uh, off doctrine. You also got the one who but say, Yeah, I believe in Yahweh Shah, say they, they believe and got the faith, but when it comes towards the works, the action don't show. You know, you got to have action with, you know, with that works. You got to have action with that faith. You know, so, you know, we're just going to get a couple precepts. Start off with Titus. Uh, chapter 1 and verse 16. They profess that they know Yahweh, but in works they deny him, being unbornable and disobedient unto every good work reprobate. Right? Because these folks, on um, saying they know Yahweh by Shem Yahweh with their mouth they they clearly say that all the time i know god i believe in god but when it comes to it they they mind somewhere else you know because in reality they, they really reject, rejecting yahweh shot what that's why the lord say if any man think you deceiving him you deceiving yourself <laughs> mm -hmm. you know because a lot of folk run their mouth and say they believe in the lord but in knowing deep nine they don't because they don't walk in the ways of yahweh shim yahweh shot like we always say, we not perfect, but you know, we gonna you gonna try your best, you know, to your ability, you know, to walk like the Lord wants you to walk, man. You okay. know, quick preach. You got it. It's the book of uh Saint uh Saint John 14, verse 15. If you love me, keep my commandments. Mm. So like that that you know sums it all up. You know, it, it um oh, yeah. oh it pretty much sums it up, you know. That that's the, that shows the faith and also the love of Yah of Yah by Shem mm. You know you willing to profess and actually have the works to match it. You know what I'm saying? You got the faith. You, it's, it's one thing to say I believe. It's another thing to actually believe with the works to follow behind it. You mm. know that that's actually stamping it. You know that's like uh, it, uh, uh, uh what's another analogy? Like I'm, I'm the best basketball player. You know what I'm saying? Right. I'm gonna have my works behind it to prove it. You know, uh, everybody like Floyd Mayweather. He got the works behind the proof, like he's that that type of boxer. You know what I'm right. saying? So we said, we, if we love the Lord, Yahweh we gonna make, we gonna do what He says, do what He says, right? And, and keep the law to the best of our ability. That right. shows the love, right? We want to be set apart from this world, you know, just to show and profess, you know, the names of Yahweh that we ain't trying to stand still for the name. Mm. Mm. Chapter four, verse one. Uh, I can go back to Titus. Oh, yeah, okay. You can okay, kind of. This Titus 1 and 16, they profess that they know Yahweh by Shem Yahweh But in works, they deny him. You know what I'm saying? So that's pretty much a hypocrite. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Because anybody can say this, you know, <laughs> but is you following up with your actions, you know what I'm saying? Your, 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 your works, you know? Everybody can say, I, I believe, I can believe, I can believe, you can say you believe all day. Mm -hmm. Right, if them, if them words don't match up, match up. You just, 
you just talking, right? Yep. You just all You're talk. That's why the Lord say, hey, depart from I never knew you, right? To the one that, that said they believe in Yahweh, but Yahweh, Yahweh, also, like you said, um, um, the one that actually prophesied him, right? But not coming up with the full 100% doctrine, not talking about Jacob's trouble, right? Not talking mm -hmm. about the MOTB, right? The Karag, the grain of rice, the Revelation 13, 16 on down, you know? The Lord, the Lord sees it all, right? He said, hey, I have uh, 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 eyes that watch over the sinful kingdom, you mm -hmm. know? What, Amos 9? Yeah. Amen. You know? Uh, what you want? Uh, Matthews 9? No, you want Matthew. <laughs> All right, this book of Matthew 15, verse 8. This people draw nigh unto me with their mouth and honoreth me with their lips. Right, and what he just said, they profess they know him. <laughs> mm -hmm. So they, they draw nigh to you. How about Shemiah Bashar with their word? They try to make it as it, try to like manifest it as it clear that they know the Lord, but knowing they don't, you know? Because when the prophet, and another thing, cause when the Lord got the prophet set up out here, you reject the prophets. Uh -huh. So you can't know Yahweh by Shemiah Shah. That's why the scripture go back what it is in um Peter, second Peter, third Peter, when they say, uh they don't know they they don't know the Lord, so they don't know us. Uh -huh. You know, the reference paraphrasing, because they don't. Uh -huh. You know? But yeah. It says this people draw up not unto me with their mouth and honor of me with their lips, mm. but their heart is far from me. Meaning they mind, they mind far, your mind, they mind somewhere else. Hey, that, and I got people, man, just being real. I got family members, you know. I got a sister. <laughs> hey, she do what she do, you know what I'm saying? She got a thing going on. But when it comes to it, hey, they go to church. <laughs> they say they believe in God, but hey, I, I got the hundred, the, the full doctrine, you know, through the spirit. Uh, or you have about Shemiah Bashar, but it's to the point. They saying this and that, but they moving like they moving like they moving, but saying they still believe in Yahweh Shem mm Yahweh -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So in other words, they heart, they mind somewhere else. They 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 saying it with their lip. They yeah, they give them honor with their lip. Yeah, I believe in God. Pray God, sing church song, do all that shit. You know what I'm saying? But they mind somewhere else because they still got they defiled ways going on. Mm -hmm. They don't want <laughs> they they want to put away the laws. Yep. Yeah. You know, what I'm saying? and that's that's it right there. You like you. Once you put away them laws, you're pretty much looking like a heathen now. You're looking yep, like a brute fine. beast. Yeah, brute beast. That's you know what I'm saying? Are. So you can. It's easy to say, especially you know, in today's time. You know, you had Jake. They quick to say, "Uh, I don't give all all all, all, all glory to, to to God." They sometimes they jazz it up and say to the Most High. Mm, yeah. You know what I'm saying? But behind the scenes, they doing every defiled thing up under the sun. They saying, and talking about they believe in yeah. How about Shimia Shai got faith in God, but you know what I'm saying? To the point, the Lord, like, nah, no, you don't. I'm not doing nothing. You, know you just running, you just running your, you just running your mouth. Mm -hmm. You just saying that, bro. I like the Lord. No, He said I know those who are mine. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know those belong to me. Mm -hmm. But you know, it's the you point. gonna move, you gonna move a certain way. Right, you gonna move a certain way, like we you said. You set man. apart, holy God. <laughs> and like we said, we not perfect, bro. It, but it's we not perfect, but. If once you once you starting to repent and come back to your how about Shemiah Bashar, bro, some shit you gonna let go. You know we ain't gonna be a hundred percent perfect, but a lot of things you gonna let go. You know what I'm saying? Try your best. You know what you got? Uh, if you wanna, uh, what you do with it? You wanna jump in? You can jump in that one. All right, you go. To, I said twenty nine thirteen. What you said? These people honor me with their mouth, but they they hearts are far away. Um, dang, did you finish reading the rest of it? Verse nine. Yeah. Oh. What, what nine said? I think said doctrines of men. Yeah, yeah, get that, get that. It says, um, this Matthew, I start from top. Uh -huh. Matthew fifteen, verse eight. This people draw not unto me, and this red letter, right? Mm -hmm. Indicating how was I speaking. This people draw not unto me with their mouth, and honor of me with their lips, but their heart is far from me. And I want to say one more thing, right? Everybody's easy to say. I'm gonna give all honor and glory to God, right? But they're not doing <laughs> the will of Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shah, mm. right? Ecclesiastes 12 and 13, it's, it's the whole duty of man, keep the commandments, mm. you know? Um, Verse nine, but in vain, they do worship me. Ooh, in a worthless way. They worship Yahweh Shem Yahweh in a worthless way, man. Saying all that, but it worthless. Cause 
Nah, go ahead. Like you got, no, you got hey, that I'm is like it. with you know these folks to be at the BT award, get they they, they get they uh they get they uh Grammy or whatever trophy it is. I don't give up on glory to God, but behind they did so many rituals, the foul rituals. They just saying to, it with their mouth. You know, <laughs> it's easy to say, oh, thank you, God. <laughs> right. You know, it's easy to say don't worry. Yeah. But what is you really, you're not really proving yourself in the way that he actually wants you to walk. Right. You know? So that shit worthless. Mm -hmm. it, it was in vain. It just, man. <laughs> you got uh, It says, but in, but in vain, they do worship me. Teaching, uh, it's like, but in vain, they do worship me. Teaching for doctrines. The commandments of men right and that's what they and like the brother said they get up there and say this and that but the teaching what they learned of is doctrine of man you know what i'm saying they learn from man doctrine the move how they move and carry on but still saying they believe in god that that would make it worthless and vain what's the hey what's the last thing that just came around fourth of july you know Ooh, god. You, got, you got all these pagan uh uh folly days we call them mm -hmm. you know but they believe in god you know? Right, but you celebrating some of that ain't even got the nothing to do with Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah. The Lord got all these high holidays in the Bible, but you don't want to do that when the man of the Lord is out here telling you about it, but you'll go celebrate Esau Edom, so called white man, which is the red man. You'll go celebrate all his pagan holidays, mm -hmm. but don't need to do nothing with Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shah saying, say, mm -hmm. you believe in God and you love God. Mm -hmm. You know? Yeah, I would say, hey. They profess that they know me, but then they Ooh. work. They deny me, right? Because, hey, that's a slap in the face. I give you high holy days to go by. Passover, mm. you know what I'm saying? Day of Atonement. Mm. You know what I'm saying? These these is high holy days. Set up. This will make you different from these other nations, right? So you say, believe in me. But soon as 4th of July came, well, I got all my fireworks. I got my charcoal for the grill. <laughs> got I got everything I got, I got ready. Them, I got them pork chops ready. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So it's like, you right. really... It's like you're trying to slap, give them a slap in the face. You're a hypocrite. Yeah, hypocrite. You know what I'm saying? So he said, hey, but in vain they do worship me, but teaching for doctrine the commandments, commandments of men. Right. We can literally go back and break down every pagan holiday, mm -hmm. the origin of it, man. Mm -hmm. And it's not pretty. It's not for us. Right. It has something to do with us, like in, in a negative way, you know? So, you know, that is the point, you know, for teaching for the doctrines, commandments of men. And also with that, um, Jesus all that believe in white jesus man that doctrine of man man that's why we've been brainwashed with that doctrine so long that's why a lot of y'all move like y'all move and can't even come up out of that you know crazy hey you stop by doctrines of man and go back to the curses you know what i'm saying deuteronomy 28 was it 48 he said put a yoke on upon our neck on our net. so you have to destroy yeah. thee you know what i'm saying we know through the spirit that destroyed was a more so of a of a uh mentally destroyed mm -hmm. you know you you hey you put away from your heritage all the way you was Pretty much brain, brain fuck. Yep. <laughs> really? You know, kind of. Um, you said Isaiah. Uh, yep, twenty nine thirteen, okay. and that's the thing. We gonna run it back because Isaiah twenty nine thirteen gonna say the same thing. Come on, man. This is book of Isaiah twenty nine verse thirteen. Wherefore the Lord Yahweh, by Hashem Yahusha, said, For as much as this people draw near me with their mouth. And with their lips do honor me, mm. but have removed their heart far from me. Mm. And their fear toward me is taught by the precept of men. See, and that fear, see, that's another thing. When it comes to all these, believe these different religions and teaching all the Bible, they don't teach you, don't none of the belief outside of the Bible teach you to name about the fear of the Lord. Don't nobody teach you about you're supposed to figure how about Shemi Abishai. They don't teach that, especially the Christian church. You know what I'm saying? They don't teach you that you're supposed to fear the Lord. The, everything they teach you about, <laughs> yeah, how about Shemi Abishai, always good. Prosperity. Prosperity, motivate, everything always good. They ain't never saying, hey, the Lord killing, putting you to death. You know, the Lord, hey, slaying you. You know, they don't, they don't talk on, they don't speak on none of that, how the Lord kill, man, and take life. Can't let you know his name. Hey, I'll I, I shot you. You know what I'm saying? The mm -hmm. demon like power. Yeah, you know what I'm yeah, saying? He's a man like power. They're not telling you that. You know, that's why that would make you fear. Yeah. You know? That would make you want to keep the commandments. Terrible demon like power, man. Yeah. I yeah. got to teach you that. Nah, you got all what you say. Yeah, quick, just a quick precept. Go ahead, you go This is Isaiah um, 1. I start at verse 3. The ox knoweth his owner and the ass his master's crib, but Israel doth not know when people doth not consider. A sinful nation, a people laden with iniquity, hmm. a seed of evildoers, children that are corruptors, 
they have forsaken the Lord. They have provoked the Holy One of Israel unto anger, and they are going away backward. And it's just the point, you know. Mm. They pretty much confessing Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shah, but they steady going towards Esau Edom, you know, right. and, and the thing that he has set up to in today's time, you know. Verse five: Why should you be stricken any more? You will revolt more and more. The whole head is sick, and the whole heart faint. Mm. And I mean, he can keep going down, but you know, just the point, you know. Pretty much, our people going backwards, even though they confessing that they they going forward, you know. Right. They think they going forward mm -hmm. with the doctrine of man. <laughs> they think with the doctrine of man, they thinking they move forward because how man taught them about the Lord. Mm -hmm. He loved everybody. The Lord good. So they think they moving forward, but really you moving backwards. Because mm -hmm. when the truth really come out about how you how about some outside work, you rejected it mm -hmm. and still moving upon your own opinion, your own vain understanding. And it's like, you know, hey, Esau teach you, you can eat, you can eat pork, you eat swine. You know what I'm saying? They go towards that. You know what I'm saying? Like, our people is pretty much to the point. It just, it's like, it is to the point. Um, Damn. My bad. Oh, you go ahead. I lost my train of thought. <laughs> nah, you good. See the notification and shit through my, uh, through my mind. Nah, you good. Um, but like we say, man, these folks, hey, they going way backward, man. Hey, then this generation, y'all worse than the forefather. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Which we are our forefathers. Hey, this that, this the generation of vipers right here, like y'all should say, man. Like the most wicked generation. Yeah, the most ever. wicked is ever. Like that's why the Lord say, but I got to burn them. You know what I'm saying? And he said, hey, the, from the sole of the foot. Ooh. I don't know. It's sick. And, what, and that is like if you is into horse racing. You know what I'm saying? If your if your horse messed up, what are they gonna do to that horse? It's, mm -hmm. it's not worth nothing. Right. Got to kill it. Yeah, and that is what it is, right? You know, two thirds they get put away, put to death anyway. But you know, you don't steer too far. Hey, you know, it's just the point, man. You got um, whatever sit on that on um, Isaiah one. Yeah, uh, twenty yeah, nine. Yeah, yeah, we can go yeah. to um, whatever for John. Okay. Then we do Hosea four six. After that. To the point, man. Like, yeah, the Lord gonna get ready. Everybody with, them, with the bus. Um, hey, they just like Tupac said on the song. Everybody kissing that thing. They gonna heaven ain't going. I put my soul on it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> hey, it's to the point because a lot of these folks, especially like these Christians, they think they actually going. They think they got a better chance than us. You know what I'm saying? They when we out there, they look at us like regular niggas. Like them man, who just nigga with bowels, just talking shit, reading. But yeah. I'm knowing, man, we coming in the full truth of Yahweh Shah. Yahweh Shah hated. We were teaching that like Yahweh Shah was. Shit, the Lord said, no, if they hate you, nigga, they hated me first. Mm -hmm. So me like a real prophet, like, you know what I'm saying? You're not going to get the props. Yeah. Right. So you can go back to the Bible, man. Yeah. You can go back to the Bible. Yeah. You can go back to the Bible. Yeah. Like these false pastors and, and teaching. You know what I'm saying? You're not going to get that. Because they, they professing, they, they, they saying they know the Lord, but they fucking don't. They sell. Mm -hmm. When we actually give them that reproof, that correction. It shows. It shows. Like, <laughs> nah, I ain't trying to listen to you. My pastor said different. Right. But it, your pastor done took a whole oath to lie to you. Yo, huh? <laughs> that just show you got dang y'all they folk running their mouth. You got uh This is the book of first John two verse three. And hereby we do know that we know him if we keep his commandments. It said if we keep his commandment. Matter of fact, you can grab Ecclesiastes twelve and thirteen. Mm-hmm. It says, and hereby we do know that we know him if we keep his commandments. Like, hey, you go back, everything we, every video we talk about all go, go full circle. So, hey, back from what I said from the beginning, you know, John, first, uh, John 14 and 15, if we love him, we can keep his commandments. I think, if I'm mistaken, that's in red letter as well, you know? So, mm -hmm. we've shown that we love you. How about you? I should be keeping his commandment because that shows you walking a whole different path from the world, yep. you know? You got it, huh? All right, this is Ecclesiastes chapter 12, verse 13. It say, let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter. The conclusion means to sum it all up. <laughs> yeah, con. Fear Yahweh and keep his commandment. Woo, and it say, fear Yahweh. This is like, I just want to say this. Okay. And it say, fear Yahweh and keep his commandment. But what the, uh, it, when you go back to uh, Isaiah 29, what did they say? What they, they fear towards me, taught by the precepts of man. Mm -hmm. That means, so the thing the man teaching ain't teaching you to fear the Lord. Mm -hmm. You know, they ain't they ain't tell you got to goddamn be scared. They ain't telling you to be you gotta be afraid of the Lord, be scared. Mm -hmm. You gotta watch how you walk. They ain't telling you that. You gotta but, walk on eggshell, yeah, but you, you right. 
But what the Lord say, fear Yahweh and keep his commandment. But the but the thing with man t but the thing y'all be taught towards him, the fear the fear towards him is the precepts of man. Man ain't telling you to fear the Lord. Yeah, I don't want to just say that. No, you know. oh, let me keep reading. Okay, let us hear uh Ecclesiastes 12 and 13. Let us hear the conclusion of the whole matter. Fear Yahweh and keep his commandments, for this is the whole duty of man. That's the whole purpose, man. Fear Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shah and keep his commandments. If you're not doing so, that means you just you just running your lips. You know what I'm saying? And, and the Lord already talks about how uh, uh, our fruit's going to show. Mm, you know, your fruit's going to show if you're really actually serving the Lord in sincerity or not. It's going to, it's, it's going. this is one thing that you cannot um, flex around. It's going to show. God. Yes, sir. Yeah. Oh, I got some more. I'll read 14. For okay. Yahweh shall bring every work into judgment. See, every work until judgment. So everything you do, all that, yeah, I know the Lord, but you ain't putting that work. The Lord gonna bring that in judgment. Mm -hmm. now, you said you believe me, right? <laughs> but you yeah, didn't. Yeah, but you didn't. Then I said, <laughs> message, stop eating shrimp crab. I stuff. heard you saying that with your mouth, but towards the work, like like you said, I, you instead of eating shrimp crab, shrimp crab, crab, lobster pork, you you still, and all the foul food still moving upon your own understanding. You still got a Jesus cross on your damn chest. You feel oh, all man. that? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Come on, man. For how I mean, she like for your how should bring every work into judgment with every secret, with every secret thing, whether it be good or whether it be evil. Woo. Mm. So the Lord judge for the good and the bad. Dang. Or did that tab have a bunch of good deeds on them, a bunch of bad ones? Ain't that evil too? Mm. The saying, you know, the Lord, but you ain't walking in. Hey, you ain't walking in the Lord way. That, and that, and, and this one, this, this be the crazy thing with Jake. I believe in a high power. What the hell your higher power telling you to do there? Mm. <laughs> right. You know, you know what, what I'm saying? saying? Like, it'd be like, so what, what is he telling you? He tell you to walk around and act like a nigga with his head cut off? Man, I had one dude at work say, yeah, I, be, I, I, well, I believe in the higher power. I believe in the God. I believe in the higher power, but I thank God it's the son. I'm like, what? Yeah. I say, yeah, man. He has, his ass got to be fried and made to the sun. Right, yeah. He but what's Chris say? His head, the whole, the whole head is sick. <laughs> but the whole, <laughs> right. You he, know? I'll throw it off with that one. But, brother, throw it off. But, you know, it's the point, man. It's, uh, what, We hit the hose. Oh, what you say? You got that? Yeah. I'll go ahead. Right, this, first, this first John 2, verse 3 again. And hereby we do know that we know him if we keep his commandments. He that saith, I know him and keep not his commandments is a liar and a, and the truth is not in him and the truth is not in him so all that uh running your mouth and saying you know the lord hey the truth ain't in you when you mm. saying all that you said that's why the lord say hey in vain mm -hmm. you know y'all worship him in vain because you just saying it running your mouth but it's worthless because y'all don't fear and because it the, the beginning to know the Lord, man, you gonna feel the Lord. That's just like when I came in the truth, the first thing I I, I ain't hear no good motivation to speak about Yahweh Shabbat Shabbat when I when the truth truth was out, everything man, I fear I was like, well shit, let me get right. I don't wanna end up Lord turn me over out here. You know what I'm saying? I got brought in by the fear when I was first hearing brothers coming in, you know? Hey, kind of sloppy. Nah, yeah. Proverbs one and five, a wise man with healing with Chris Lane. Mm -hmm. And we jumped down to verse seven, you know. The fear of the Lord is beginning to wisdom. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Once you start fearing the Lord for real, he's going to start by keeping the commandments. Yeah, you going to, man. You know what I'm saying? Thank you. He's going to keep pouring out that spirit more into you. But damn, I see I see the hypocrites in these folks. They say they love the Lord, but they can't put down the weed. They can't put down the crap. Or they can't put down the, the harlot type dress. That's the worldly thing. You know, kind. The worldly, the worldly, the worldly ways. You know, so it's like, like, like we said, full circle, man. They honor me with their mouth, but they, they, yeah. their mind is far from you. Right, cause like you said, cause they 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 friend with the world, mm -hmm. you know, friend of the world. Hey, you an enemy to y'all by shooting y'all shot. En enmity. <laughs> <laughs> so you a straight enemy, man. So they, like you say, they that's what the Lord said. They say it with their mouth, but y'all mind somewhere else. Why? Cause you a friend of the world. You mm -hmm. love the world. You just running your mouth. Huh. Then um, verse five. But whoso keep up his word. In him, verily is the love of Yahweh Shemal Shah perfected. Right? Come back, going back to verse uh um 
John 14 and 15, you know, they that love the Lord, you know, keep his commandments, rough to paraphrase him. Yeah. It says, but whoso keepeth his word in him, verily is the love of Yahweh Shemashah perfected. Hereby know we that we are in him. He that saith he abideth in him, ought himself also so to walk, mm. even as he walked, right? So mm. how Yahweh Shai walk, we have to be a shadow right behind him, you know? Trying our best to our ability, right? He walked that straight, straight uh, narrow arrow, you know what I'm saying? And we trying our best to our ability to walk the same way, Come. you know? But it starts off by keeping the law statutes come to the best of our ability. You got it, huh? Come on. Uh, this is Isaiah. That was it on the um, whole thing? With that one? Yeah, with mine I had. Right? Okay. I'm going to jump on Hosea 4 and 6. It said, My people are destroyed from my lack of knowledge. It said, Because thou have rejected knowledge, I also will, I also. It's like I'm running back. My people uh, are, the, uh, it's like my people are destroyed from a lack of knowledge. Because thou have rejected knowledge, I will also reject thee, that thou should be no priest to me. Saying thou hast forgotten the law of thy Yahweh, I will also forget thy children. Right. And what the Lord said, hey, people, hey, hey, people destroy from a lack of knowledge. Cause why? Cause they talk by the precepts of man. You the, 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 your fear towards Yahweh should me, I was shy, talk by man. That gon' hey, have you destroyed, hey, gonna have, give you that lack of knowledge of Yahweh Shimmy Abasha, the teaching to learn about Yahweh Shai, um Yahweh Shimmy Abasha, mm -hmm. having counsel of the Lord. The precepts of man ain't gonna leave you astray from that, mm -hmm. you know. And and I say that because when you go back, when we go get that Matthew seven, hey, what he said, my people are described from a lack of knowledge. I'm ready, matter of fact, I'm ready back. Hosea four and six, my people are described from. I mean, it's destroyed for a lack of knowledge because thou have rejected knowledge. I will also reject thee. And he said because thou have has rejected knowledge, the Lord gonna reject you. That way, I go in that scripture, man. The Lord say, depart from me, I never knew you. Because you reject knowledge. Mm -hmm. Whether you did have the truth. I mean, not whether you had the truth. Like, and whether you was out here saying you was on the corner prophesizing. You know, you got your garment, you got your fringes on your shirts. And your doctrine ain't right. That you got men like over like, well, bro, now that ain't what they're really going into, brother. Mm -hmm. They going like this and you rejecting it. Mm -hmm. You, you, Because you rejecting it. Yeah, how about you? I'm shy still at the end of the day. You know, you reading the scripture, but you still rejecting the knowledge what you read. Mm -hmm. So you ain't really taking heed to it. You ain't taking heed to it like you're supposed to. But that's why that scripture down because hey the Lord gonna get rid of a lot of y'all, man. Tell y'all, say the Lord gonna tell y'all he don't know y'all running back one more time. We can get that Matthew you can put it. One, two, I think it's seven twenty-three. Matthew chapter seven. On oh, this Hosea four and six, one more time, my people are destroyed from lack of knowledge. Because thou have reject knowledge, I will also reject thee, right? And what the Lord for to do in the next verse, next chapter we forget, that thou should be no priest to me, seeing that I have forgotten the law of Yahweh, I will also forget thy children, right? Lord gonna forget y'all in a few minutes. Lord gonna make it to the point. Yeah, he created everybody, but the Lord gonna put it to the point like I never knew you. <laughs> I don't know you. Come. Uh, this is the book of Matthew. Sound, I'm starting verse 20. Okay. This is whereby their fruits ye shall know them right and like i said this is the red letter right now i meant to say i ain't meant to say 20 what i meant to say 20 21 but you know you start where you start from go ahead i, mm -hmm. like, I know i had to say 23 my bad no you good yeah i had i had y'all like uh, nah, kind we understand <laughs> it's a um whereby their fruits ye shall know them right mm -hmm. and that It says, not everyone that saith unto me, Lord, Lord, shall enter into the kingdom mm. of heaven. Right, everybody who calling on the Lord name, Yahweh by Shem Yahweh Shot. Do you not, man, everybody not gonna make it. Like I say, a lot of folk know the name. They just like you had two people pulled up on us when we was out on count Saturday. I mean, when I was now two, so the 4th of July. Like, what y'all teach them? Like, you know what I'm saying? Y'all got flight. Like, now nah, we got the knowledge you can come get. They ain't get out the car. But then they start screaming, yeah, you how about shit me out shot, but they ain't want to get out the car. That's not what we're doing, what we're teaching, but they ain't want to get out the car and see what's going on. Mm -hmm. But like, yeah, I'll pray you how about shit me out shot. Mm -hmm. It's like, you know, if you're going to dial in two, you're going to dial all the way into this truth. Right. If I don't, if I'm no, I'm not for the guy out the car, I ain't need for to stop asking no question what you teach. Mm -hmm. I'm just, right, you know what I'm saying? Keep choking about me, man. Because if I stop in, you know what I'm saying? And 
that question, I'm out of way to get out and listen. Mm -hmm. But then, like I said, they rolled off saying the name. Yeah, you know, y'all about shooting y'all shot, all that. But the Lord in a few minutes gonna tell these folks, I don't even know y'all. Mm -hmm. They know the name. <laughs> you know, but it's the point. You got it, all. It says, uh, Matthew 7, verse 21. Not everyone that saith unto me, Lord, Lord, shall enter into the kingdom of heaven, but he that doeth the will of my Father he which said, is in heaven. He said, He that doeth the will of the Father. Hey, what Yahweh about Shema Shah said? I mean, Shalaki, what Yahweh Shah said? Ain't nobody, my, my brother, ain't nobody, my bro, ain't nobody, my brother, real path for everybody, want to do the will of my Father. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, Ecclesiastes 12 and 13, just the whole duty of man. man he ain't doing that. You ain't in the fold. <laughs> Ooh, kind. You know, it's all go back doing the will, like it say. You on it? Do you folk on it? Y'all about to mouth shot with their mouth, but they mind somewhere else. Cause why they ain't doing the will? They they running their mouth, but not doing the will. Yeah. Uh -huh. Verse twenty two. It says, "Many will say to me in that day, Lord, Lord, have we not prophesied in Thy name? Right. So we, Lord, we can't. We we know the name. Y'all about to mouth shot. We say we was out there. You know, t like." What's going on? Mm -hmm. <laughs> but problem? I ain't even tell these folks the, 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 the correct breakdown mm. of the MOT because that's what we, we Ooh, heavy on God. right now. This is right here in our face. You know, so hey, like we said, we bring we talking about the two thirds that, that say they know the Lord and and, and don't want to keep the law touch commandments, and we also tapping into the ones that say they know you how about Shemiah Shah, but not even teaching about the prophecy that's gonna go down. This major prophecy, right? The hour of temptation, you know. So hey, they think Matter of fact, hey, the main camp, IUIC, we, we, we speak on, you know, they have a lot of blood. They they elder, mm -hmm. or they bishop have a lot of blood on his hands, right? He have a, a, the biggest congregation, mm -hmm. you know? So in the times of coming Jacob's trouble, hey, Lord, Lord, we ha haven't we not prophesied that name? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was talking, but y'all wasn't talking the truth. <laughs> right. <laughs> you know, y'all leading them folks into a hole. Yep, leading them astray. You know, see, I, I have a lot of blood on y'all hands. You tell them to make the chips and when it come, they you gonna make them you gonna make them wanna get it when it get mm -hmm. real. That just like when the C19 came out with the Victoria's Secret, whatever you wanna mm -hmm. call it, right? Hey, go ahead and take it. Mm -hmm. I ISPK. Go ahead and take it so we can get back to our goddamn fishing. Yep, get I, that you jab. was mocking the yeah, shit. Go get that jail. You know? So it's like, hey, like we saying, hey, scripture says, Slocky, Lord Lord, have we not prophesied inside thy name? Hey, what it says? It says, Many were saying to me that day. Lord, Lord, have we not prophesied in thy name and in thy, and, and in thy name have cast out devils and in thy name done many wonder, wonderful works? Hmm. And then... Oh, so nah, yeah. nah, I'm oh. just saying. Oh, and then I will profess unto them, hmm. I never knew you. The Lord gonna make it manifest. He gonna make it clear. He gonna profess. <laughs> he gonna make it clear and manifest. Like, nigga, I don't know you. You get what? You gotta be eating on your kids. Woo. Marshall, I'm gonna goddamn come in. Yep. Hit you in the back of the face with the gun. Yep. Hit Woo. you in the face with the back of the gun. You know what I'm saying? You get you gonna you gonna know for sure you're not you're not part of your luck. Hey, when they when the Lord put them spirit crazy for vision down here and crank up on the whole love, that what y'all gonna be doing? Praying, yeah. Lord, y'all about to what's going on? Have mm -hmm. I not? Man, I don't know you. Mm -hmm. Hey, this shit gonna be taking a hold of y'all. You people. told the folk gonna take the goddamn the 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 C nineteen. You told the folk gonna take the Karagma. But we was out there catching that devils. We was out there, you know, getting the seat up out the people, mm -hmm. you know, removing them from the lies and the the things they were taught, but you still had fall okay, certain stuff y'all saying. Yo, you were saying look, but when it comes to the, the major prophecy, but y'all off. Uh, we know y'all had holes in your dutch. Right. You took yeah, the oath holes the in it. Right. You probably said a little thing to make a nigga think. You know what made somebody think? Like, yeah, he right, he got a point. Hey, the Lord could have used you to just to spark ding, hit that light bulb. You know, and they had to get them up, but you still teach fall doctrine and lead them to the, the right doctrine. Mm -hmm. Right, you cast out that 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 deceit, that deceitful spirit he had. Mm, that that Caesar was just spirit. Right, you <laughs> cast that devil's right. You cast out that devil spirit, that line deceitful spirit. But to the point, hey, Lord gonna be like, nah, like we did one for work, right? You had your posters and your signs out there, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Working like, damn, with the Bible and everything leaking up, like, yeah, you you did some wonderful works. With the gift, what the Lord gave with the word, you know what I'm saying? With your little signs and posts, but still, your doctrine was out, bro. Uh -huh. <laughs> it wasn't him. You wasn't the elect. That's right. wasn't what it come, gonna boil down to. You wasn't my chosen. I used you as a small vessel to wake up the, 
Wake up the next man. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? But hey, depart from me. Because guess what? Once you woke him up, he figured out the lie that y'all was speaking yep. on. And it's uh. like with the um the video had went around with the um was it the dude from WFI? Mm. You know? He was like, Yeah, that shit off. Because mm. they, they don't believe inside the other uh, MO TV. They don't believe in the Karagma. You know? And he was like, nah, bro, that shit off. And he removed from that camp. Mm. You know what I'm saying? So it hey, can be brothers like that in them camps, right? Unless they repent, right? But until then. Hey, in those times, Logan said, hey, depart from me. I never knew you. Mm. You knew the truth, right? But you wanted to. Okay, that's the thing. And the Lord, because they hear what we saying, the, the actual the, the actual truth, what yeah. the Lord got the spirit on the man's eye to put out, they hear it, but they're still rejecting it. Yeah. They want to keep teaching their own, leaning on their own vain opinion. Yeah. You know? That was it on that, though. But, you know, that's the point, man. Uh, hey, like the Lord say, man. You work, hey, you that work iniquity. You that, hey, working out that sin, man. But, you know, that's the point. So, with all that, I'm going to say, Barakatha Yahweh, Barakatha Yahweh, Barakatha Yahweh, Barakatha Yahweh, Barakatha Yahweh, Barakatha Yahweh. With that, Shalom, and double honor and blessing to the ill, the Apostle Great Millstone. Peace and salutation for the brothers out there doing this work. It's a serious cross folk on earth where you might be scattered abroad, along with the confusion of faces. And Shalom to Fu Akwa, I believe as well, I mean, the sister, the one coming back. That say shalom. Shalom.